The current measure has remained virtually unchanged over the past 30 years. Yet during that time, there have been marked changes in the nation's economy and society and in public policies that have affected families' economic well-being, which is not reflected in the measure. There are many kinds of pond, but nearly all are small bodies of shallow, stagnant water in which plants with roots can grow. Water movement is slight and temperatures fluctuate widely. The wealth of plants ensures that during daylight hours oxygen is plentiful. However, at night, when photosynthesis no longer takes place, oxygen supplies can fall very low. It is important to note that saving is not the same as investment. Saving is about cash, while investment is about real product. The difference is important because money, being liquid, can leak out of the economic system, which it does when someone who is putting aside unspent income keep it under the mattress.
Fractional Reserve Banking is a banking system in which banks only hold a fraction of the money their customers deposit as reserves. This allows them to use the rest of it to make loans and thereby essentially create new money. This gives commercial banks the power to directly affect the money supply. The purpose of the informative speech is to provide interesting, useful, and unique information to your audience. By dedicating yourself to the goals of providing information and appealing to your audience, you can take a positive step towards succeeding in your efforts as an informative speaker. Before the discovery of Australia, people in the old world were convinced that all swans were white, an unassailable belief as it seemed completely confirmed by empirical evidence. The sighting of the first black swan might have been an interesting surprise for a few scientists, but that is not where the significance of the story lies.
Australians speak English of course. But for many tourists and even some locals, Australian English has only tenuous links with mother tone. Our speech is prepared with words and phrases whose arcane meanings are understood only by the initiate. It is these colourful colloquialisms that Australian slang set to truly explain. In the past, naming English as a separate subject seemed relatively easy. The textbook selected and graded items of language which were put into content and then practiced intensively. New items were carefully controlled so that the student could cope quite easily. Now that English is used as a medium of instruction, Globalization has affected what we eat in ways we are only beginning to understand. Modern food production no longer relates to our biological needs but is in direct conflict with them. The relationship between diet and our fertility, our risk of cancer, heart disease and mental illness is becoming clearer. Yet much of our food is nutritionally bankrupt.
The provision of accurate and authoritative statistical information strengthens modern societies. It provides a basis for decisions to be made on such things as where to open schools and hospitals, how much money to spend on welfare payments and even which football players to replace at half-time. Along with customary classes on subjects such as finance, accounting, and marketing, today's MBA students are enrolling on courses for environmental policy and stewardship. Indeed, more than half of business schools require a course in environmental sustainability or corporate social responsibility, according to a survey of 91 U.S. business schools, published in October 2005. Social media are playing an increasingly important role as information sources for travelers. The goal of this study is to investigate the extent to which social media appear in search engine results in the context of travel-related searches. It also provides evidence for challenges faced by traditional providers of travel-related information.
This book is no ordinary book, and should not be read through from beginning to end. It contains many different adventures, and the path you take will depend on the choices you make along the way. The success or failure of your mission will depend on the decisions you make, so think carefully before choosing. For any marketing course that requires the development of a marketing plan, such as marketing management, marketing strategy and segmentation support marketing, this is the only planning handbook that guides students through the step-by-step -step creation of a customized marketing plan while offering commercial software to aid in the process. Where there are effects, there are often side effects. The car is a boon to mobility, but can lead to obesity, deaths and pollution. Burning fossil fuel may keep economies goings but wrecks the climate in the long run. In a similar way, there are side effects to information technology and education setting from childcare to the classroom to the lecture hall and beyond.
Food is one of the most important things you'll ever buy. And yet most people never bother to think about their food and where it comes from. People spend a lot more time worrying about what kind of blue jeans to wear, what kind of video games to play, what kind of computers to buy. The successor to the Hubble Space Telescope has been delayed yet again and will not now launch until approximately May 2020. The James Webb Space Telescope is also in danger of busting the cost cap put on the project by the U.S. Congress. Back in 2011, politicians on Capitol Hill said the observatory should not take more than $8 billion to build and $800 million to operate over five years in orbit. Britain said it will introduce the world's first public register of the owners of foreign companies holding property in the country. The move comes in response to growing concern over tax evaders and money launderers' use of shell companies to hide their identities. Most overseas companies that own property in London are registered in tax havens, particularly the British Virgin Islands.
A key finding in this study was the extent to which property managers expressed frustration at the amount of property owners who are financially unable, or just unwilling, to pay for repairs and ongoing maintenance of their rental properties. Interior and exterior painting, re-carpeting, fixing leaks and replacing ovens were all examples of maintenance that property managers said they had trouble talking landlords into doing. Children will lack the work skills they need in the future because they are not spending enough time playing, a Lego executive has warned. John Goodwin, head of Lego's charitable arm the Lego Foundation, says less time in the classroom and more time playing is the solution. The foundation has a 25% stake in the Danish toy market, giving it a vested interest in encouraging play.